Hey Butterfly Beauties, I am here yet again with another haul, but these things have been sitting in my room and I was like, I need to uh, put this up. Um, one of the things that I wanted to, and these are all going to be beauty related, this has nothing to do with planning whatsoever, because uh, I also like makeup and I've been really kind of slacking on doing all that stuff, yes, but there's my daughter in the background trying to be funny, but whatever. Um, so... Uh, I was watching some videos because I'm always looking, I'm very, um, I'm on team oily, like for real, for real, for real. I'm on team oily. So I'm always looking for something to help me be matte. Now I have some different things like air spun, etc. And, um, the Ruby Kisses, Invisible, Translucent Powder, etc. But you know, when you put them on and a woman of color, you put them on, it says no color, but it still gives you that kind of, it, it's supposed to do you because I want to be matte, but I get that white look like almost ash and then have to put a little bit more powder to bring color back if that even makes sense what I'm trying to explain but anyways I saw um Wayne Goss was talking about his RM RCMA powder and it says no color powder and I'm like hmm I watched him do I want to say on a woman of color and I was like wait it looks like it really didn't have any color but I went to go look for it on Amazon and they were talking about $30. But then I saw another video saying it does not cost that much. And a lot of people on the Amazon page was like, oh, that is way overpriced. It's like 12 bucks." So I'm like, oh, look at that. They almost got me. So I've, I was looking at another YouTuber and she actually had a link to a company, a website called Beautylish. So I want to talk about Beautylish for a minute. I absolutely love the website customer service. So all I did was order this. This is the RCMA, and it's a no-color powder. You get three ounces, and I want to say I paid like 12 bucks, and then with shipping. So it came to me for like 17 bucks or 15 something like that. But this is a no-color powder. I've used it once or twice, so I'll give you a full review a little later about utilizing this. But it came wrapped so beautiful. So it did ask me if I wanted to receive messages. It sent me a text Um via text and I said yes because I love anything you can send to me via text love it so it sends me a text message saying it was on let me know it was on the way it sent me a text message letting me know that it was delivered asked me how excited I was on a scale of one to five I re actually responded just to see what would happen and then they send me like this really cute um animated uh pic of Drake like showing how excited he is he is it was so funny I was like okay that's hilarious so then um a couple of days later, maybe two days later, after receiving the package, I received a text message from one of the customer service reps who wanted to know, was my package delivered to me beautifully? And it was. This is some really good quality um, tissue paper. Now, I know this is all about beauty, but shoot, you can use this, and I could use this in scrapbooking if I want to do something that's fashion-related. Look at this sticker. Like, seriously? So I pulled it out from this side because I didn't want to rip it so pretty this black mat for the beauty wish it was had the black and white twine I mean like they were really like thinking about it so I really appreciate that and then it had the black tissue paper so they really put thought into their packaging they also sent me a sample which is the bioderma h2o uh, it just tells you why it's the world's uh, favorite molecular water so I have one I forgot what brand who Neutrogena maybe I don't remember Mm -hmm. But this is the Bioderm one, so they sent the two samples, so it's something for me to test out. Here's the Beautylish card. It says, Welcome to Beautylish, and congratulations on discovering one of Hollywood's best-kept secrets. Um, and it has basically a journal card. So I think this is just... I I was blown away, so I definitely will go back. I mean, they have a, all kinds of makeup products there, but I will go back and peruse that site to see if there's anything else that I might want to purchase that I can't find here because I love the customer service. And I did respond to the um, young lady who texted me to let her know that I wasn't here to receive the box, but I, um, I re text her several days later basically saying that I wasn't there to respond to her originally and that I loved it and she responded back it wasn't just like oh this automated she introduced herself her name was Jennifer so I really love the customer service aspect so it is beautylish I will leave the link to that site below um, the video so you guys can go and check they have high end to things like you know this the RCMA powder so I don't want to say inexpensive because I really didn't look through the whole site I was literally looking for this but they have all different types so that's one then this is the Scandinavia so I was able to go to Scandinavia and was able to catch them during a sale where they're giving you and I see this a lot 
the um, pros use it, makeup artists use it. I've even seen like my girl Felix has used it. Uh, makeup doll uses it. Uh, the Scandinavia, so it's packaged really nicely as well as far as the wrap is concerned. So I bought the um, makeup primer spray oil control. So this will be the foundation before putting on your makeup and then the makeup finishing spray again in oil control. So I bought the set. So this is a eight fluid ounces and this also is eight fluid ounces and it was a little bit cheaper to buy the set. But both of them are oil control. As I said, I'm on team oily. It, they sent me an extra pump. That's nice. Okay. Uh, but then the free gift was to get the travel size. Uh, so again, the makeup finishing spray and the primer. And both of these are in the oil free. I picked the oil free. Oil free. So that's what I got from Scandinavia. So I will start to use it. I've never used these. Uh, so we're going to see how these work. So if you want to hear my thoughts on them, even though I've seen many um, other girls use them on YouTube, just leave me a comment below and I'll let you know uh, how it worked out for me. So again, the travel size and then the two full size for my area. Then this is from the, and let me move these out of the way real quick. And the next things that I'm going to show you are from my local beauty supply store. So I ran out of my um, BB Beauty Balm. I really do like this. It's the Kiss New York Medium Dark in the summertime. And it's a little thick, but it works for me. I like it. So I picked up another one of those. Then I also picked up, I was looking for my um, Ruby Kisses Pure Mineral Concealer and Chocolate Brown. Cannot find it, so I'm going to have to actually order it online. Uh, so I bought a, another um, LA Pro, so LA Girl Pro Concealer, and this one should be in Fawn. Is this the Fawn one? Let's see. Yeah, this one is in Fawn. So I picked that one up. So I'm, everybody knows about this. I use it all the time. Uh, I have the Nikki K. The Nikka K is the next one that I picked up in the HD concealer. And I have not used this at all. So this is going to be something I'm going to try. And the color on this one is, what was this color? I'm looking for the color, y'all. A uh, Cephia. So here it is. Cephia is the color that I picked up. So it's, again, for highlights. And I want to try this out. So it's the HD Concealer from Nika K. So we'll see how that works out. And then I bought two duo blushes. Or uh, one duo blush and a contour. So this also from Nika K. So I bought this contour palette. So it's a powder contour palette. So we're going to see. Or is this cream? I don't even know. Isn't that sad? But yeah, I picked that up to try that out. And then I really like the colors here. Um, and the blush. And you know what? Let's swatch them. Let's let's do that real quick. Uh, of course, there would be taped down really good, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. So let's try doing the blush first. Let's swatch that. So this is kind of a... I don't know what color to say this, because it has kind of a brown tint to it. It's not really coral, but let's swatch that. Looks like it has a good pigment. Oh, that's pretty. So it is matte. It's not shimmer. So I like that. So here's more of the pinky coral color. So hopefully you can see that. So they are a matte color. So here, and does it have the colors on the back? Doesn't say the color. So it doesn't give you a color at all. So it just gives you, here's the lot number in case you want to go get that. And the ND0, uh, ND002, I guess is the palette name, but it doesn't actually have the colors. So that's the blush. So let's look at the contour, because uh, I'm trying to find contour that actually is dark enough for me, but not being too dark. So that's not too bad. Can y'all see that? And then we'll put this one right here. This one's. Hmm. So I don't know if y'all can really see that. 
So here's a darker color, here's a lighter color. Hmm, let me do it here. Let me swatch again. So, oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Here's a darker one. So I'm going to put it here. Yeah, that looks better. A better swatch. There we go. And then I'll use my thumb for here because I totally screwed that up. And here's the lighter one. So we shall see how it will actually do on my face. And again, these are powders, not cream. I haven't worked that way. I barely can get the highlighting and stuff going on. And finally, my daughter was like, no, you need to buy um, this glue to do the nails, even though the kit that I got from Five Below had the glue. She said not to use those. So we've got the super nail glue. So we shall see. So that's everything that I got that is beauty related. Um, so the new to me items are the Nika K product here and the Scandinavia product and my RCMA. So these are all the new to me stuff here and my RCMA. So new to me that I will be trying. So again, if you want to hear my thoughts or you want to see me use any one of these items, just go ahead and comment below, like the video and let me know um, that yes, you'd like to see uh, me talk about any one of these items or see them actually in action besides these swatches that are here. So I will see you lovely butterfly beauties in another video. Until the next time, bye.